Ben, Wallace is here. Hi, thanks for coming by. No, nice to meet you, man. Thanks. So, um, Ben, what is it exactly that you do at the UN? Uh, I've heard of an international consortium of lawyers with a UN mandate to negotiate global copyright standards. Wow. But more importantly, are you trying to sleep with my girlfriend? Oh, no, God, I wouldn't. Don't worry, we're just, we're just talking guy. Okay. <laughs> We have a great group of, uh, of actors in this, and they're all kind of incredibly funny in all in sort of very different ways. With the beautiful and charming Zoe Kazan, Adam Driver, Mackenzie Davis, Megan Park, and Rafe Spall. I was about to say, just they just cast this movie really well, but then I realised that's a big compliment. I'm com sort of complimenting myself. <laughs> you could say like they cast all the supporting parts of this movie really well. I'm saying that. This was sort of a no-brainer. They came to me and said, you know, Radcliffe is doing it. He's perfect for Wallace. As soon as they found out he was playing Wallace in the script, I was like perfect casting. He's so relaxed and at ease and very good, I would say, leader on set. I think what we're seeing is sort of an emergence of a, of a new leading man. Wallace, you clean up nice. Yes, so do you. Zoe is just the zestiest, jumpiest person who's so, also so smart and funny. You want me to go tell her that you have six nipples? Yeah. All no, right. You know what? No, you know what? I'll do it myself. It'll be easier coming from me. <laughs> She's a fantastic presence on set. I don't know, there's just a, there's a thing to her that, that I love. She's my cousin. It's like incest. She's not my cousin. My best friend is uh, Alan, played brilliantly by Adam Driver. She has a boyfriend. I'm sorry. Mm -hmm. So sure. Adam is a, kind of a, a force of nature in terms of improvising. The things he was shouting at all people. Did you guys want to borrow some of my balls? Shark check. You couldn't find that stone if it was in your kidney. He is so funny and wonderful in this movie. I want to grind up your bones and spread you on toast. And really bizarre. I just had sex. I'm about to eat nachos. It's the greatest moment of my life. OK, where did you get beer at a children's karate tournament? We just got beer at a children's karate tournament. I play Nicole. You meet her at the very top of the movie, the same party that Wallace and Chantry meet at. Mackenzie's amazing, and she's brilliant in the movie, and uh, just really, really funny. As best man, it's your job to keep me calm so that I don't crawl out that window and go and bang a sailor. Where are you even going to find a sailor? At the dock. It did feel a bit like summer camp. On a beach all night, thinking up like the most horrific titles for Cool Whip. Puffin, loving. Dump that puff on my face. Whi Whippy, Whippy Pippitons. <laughs> <laughs> Shantry's sister Dahlia is played by Megan Park. I think you're great, but um, I can't do this. <laughs> great? You think I'm great? Oh, oh. She's a little bit crazier and, you know, more sarcastic and a little darker than Chantry. And I really liked him. I'm so sorry. I liked him so much. I don't even want to sleep with all of his friends to get back at him. I mean, I will, but I'm not going to enjoy it. She's a real trooper. <laughs> she's she's game for anything. You like Chantry. You just need to do whatever you need to do to get over it. Chantry loves Ben. Rafe Spall plays my boyfriend, Ben. It's very easy to sort of play the boyfriend as a villain. And I thought in Rafe's performance, we tried to make it not an easy call for both the audience and for Chantry. He's a viable option. In fact, you sort of are much, a much worse person than he is. <laughs> yeah. You can't interact with a woman without sex screwing it up, but I can because I'm a grown-up. And it's so adorable that you really believe that.